Hi friends, how are you all? This is the query asked by one of the reputed companies in for the post of MIR. So I request everyone to keep concentration on this. It's very important query. Okay, so many people are scratching their heads, but it's very easy but little bit complicated. That's it. Okay guys, so we have to find out the amount based on the six representative IDs. These are the IDs and these are the amount we have to find out from here. Okay guys, so it's very important before I start this session, I request everyone that like, share and subscribe my channel because there is lots of MIS interview questions I am going to post in YouTube. After completion of MIS interview questions only, I will start functions. Each and every function I will start. Still at that time, I will post only the MIS interview questions. Okay, it, the total questions are 100 plus. It may be 110 or it may be 230, I don't know. Because still I am collecting the queries from the reputed companies. It's, I already collected this one, it's an old one, I already collected and uh, for this solution, I took, for, the, uh, for this query solution, I took nearly 3 to 4 days time to solve this, 3 to 4 days time, after that I found it, ok, so I am explaining you each and everything, so I requesting only I am expecting from you only the like, share and subscribe. I don't want a single pie from you guys. It's totally free. Okay, for subscribe, some people asking for subscription, is there any cost? No, it, it won't be any cost. It's totally free of cost. Okay. Now, coming to this part. Now, first of all, we have to extract this PPD, all these things. Let's see all the characters from the sales representatives we have to extract the characters from the sales representative IDs ok so I will show you how to extract go indirect from first double quotes it's a text see I will show you magic over here I will get that so what it will show you means, I will explain you, it will show you how many from first character to length, how many are there, the total character it will like this, it means it having totally 7 characters in that value, okay. so from here we need, wait a minute guys, we need we have to extract the strings of the values, ok, mid, open the bracket, up to this one, comma, it's a relative reference for the reason I am not locking the cells, F9, ok, so it is extracted each and every string from the value, ok, so we need from P P P P D. these three things release from this value not the one ok observe this one guys carefully observe it's very important now I will multiply with this so if it is a text it will show you value error if it is a number it will show you the number ok value error value error value error again 1918 ok 1918 so we need values not the numbers ok so what you will do you have to do is error is error function and ok guys so keep concentration on this so wherever you find the error it will show you the true other than that it will show you the false f9 so these are the errors we found and false ok now see the magic of this now nearly 3 to 4 days 
I did lot of work, hard work for this. So math is a function. It will look the first value. It will look the first value from the range. It won't look the second and last. It will it will look only first value. So before that, I will show you S nine. We need this true, right? This true we need. From this true to this true, we doesn't need this false. Okay, we doesn't need this false. We need only still this true. Okay, control Z, match. To look up the first value from the range. False, comma. It is the look up value. I need the exact match zero F nine. So it will show you it is a false in the fourth place. Okay, it will show you the value in the fourth place. The false value is in the fourth place. Now see. Okay, now you I think you understood. Now we will take left, not left. Okay, I'll show left. I'll just left at left of this. It's not a. Uh, I'm not losing this one. Left of these many characters, F9, four characters. Okay. See, observe here, four characters. We don't need four characters. We we need only three characters. One, two, three only. Okay, guys. So what you will do? Minus one, close parenthesis. Let's see if it will work or not. It is three. Okay, now you control shift. If you press control enter, it will show you the error. Okay, F2 control shift and enter. Double click. Now we got this value. Okay, from this value you have to extract the amount from this table. Okay, guys. We look up the whole thing. This is the look up value. Okay, this is the look up value. Comma, this table. Okay, a photo lock. Comma, exact match. Column index, sorry, column index two. Comma, exact match. It's an array part, so because we are using this array array part, so it is an array part now. So control shift and enter. Double click. Okay, guys, understood. And and previously I used to explain. I stopped over some conditional format, so I will show you that one also now. Minimize this one. If you have any doubt, ask me. I will explain you. Here is MIS, 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 MIS. This is the here. I think so. Raw data, maybe here only. Eh? Mm. Yes. Okay, this one only, right? Okay. First of all, I will create this one. This one only, na? I think so. Yes, this one only. Alt H L C. Clear from selected. Okay. So first of all, we need this. PQR, okay. PQR. From here we need a PQR. Not this one, I think. So, guys, wait a minute. Let me check. Mm, this one is normal. Okay. okay, this one. Let me check. Only this one. Okay. Wait a minute, guys. Let me check. Let me check. Raw data. Okay, this one also. I remember it was a raw data, not this one. Okay, so not this one. Okay, then not this one. It's exactly this one only. So it is a <coughs> data. Okay, guys, this is a data. So you have to make it a conditional format for this. Wherever you find the PQR value, so this whole area should be selected. Okay. 
Vi skal råde det her til det, så der kan stå på spillet her. Okay, lad os kigge. Vi skal råde det her, og han kommer til den gang. Okay. Okay, okay, vi vil tage de fem. Jeg tror, vi skal råde det her, okay? Maybe de fem only. Alt, HLN. Tab, not tab, sorry, take down. This one is equal to take this one you have to log the column because it has to take me downwards okay eqr eqr okay down is equal to this one log every side of course okay and format with the fill with some uh, local colors font bold okay Okay, let's check whether it's working or not. Yes, all PQRs are there. Okay, now we have to find others. I think I explained this one. I'm thinking like that. Let's put it alt HLN take down equal to this one. If you find anything, this one. So yeah. Have to, you have to make, log the row but not the column equal to August format fill with this color ok so we will make it a bold font bold bold and black so intersection of this both we need we have to find this one ok you have to find only this one okay guys so it's very easy select the whole range alt hln page down hi friends this is the wonderful query which i am going to share with you guys asked by one of the reputed company in hyderabad so here what you have to do I don't know why he has given like this. I, I mean to say that why this query has been given by the HR or someone else for the interviewer for the post of MIS. Find the sales amount by VLOOKUP. It is one. Okay. So, in what way we have to get that sales amount when the numbers are like this it is data validation so you have to do drop down list like this to how can we get it so here is the solution guys see it's very 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 simple and this is the new method which i uh, created and I thought I tried so it got 100% so many solutions are there like we can use choose also like what I mean to say that choose of this comma you can write it Jan Feb, like this like this okay it's going to be very large till December. You have to write. So I thought, why don't you make it short? Okay, it's very large. In next method, I will explain you about the choose. Okay, see here there is a function called text. Text is the amazing function. This one, the condition comma and take this F four no no this one you have to use month okay it's very simple guys when it's two automatically it will pick up February when it's one automatically it will pick up January if it is ten it will pick up October F9, F3, 
Actually, just to pick up uh, this one. And to complete. Act nine. This is the logic. Okay. Directly it will not pick up. This is the method. See, you have to take, suppose, if you take 31 in February, 31 is there. Maximum dates and average is 28 days. So you have to use like this. Directly it will not accept. F9. See, I press enter. Later I will change to, to any other. Let's check it out. Like four, the automatically will come after. Okay, understood. You have to multiply the number with condition. Right, that is average date. I mean to say that average date is 28 days. In every month, 28 days is there. Right, for that period, you have to use 28 over here. If you use 30, in February, 30 days is not there. It may not work. It may not work. Okay, let's try it out. We can do 31. Let's see. May see. So it will not work. So you have to use average date. That is 28. Enter. F2. Now use VLOOKUP to get that sales amount. We look up. This is the lookup value that is the month, comma, and this one. Control backspace to jump to the formula, comma, two, comma, zero. Enter. It's not an array function. Okay. 439. Let me check April 439. Yes, if I change to another month, like okay, two six one seven. Okay, this is the new thing. So I thought to share with you guys, and this is already function is dead. But I after so many things are there to find out the solution, but I thought to make it very short. For that reason, I tried so many ways, so I found this is the best way which I'm going to share you. Thank you guys. Thanks for your support. Please like, share and subscribe. And when after subscribe, click on bell icon so that only you'll get a notification whenever I upload a video in YouTube. Thank you guys. Hi friends. How are you all? Here your friend Rajnikant, Excel Guru. This is the query asked from the reputed company for the candidate who, comes, who came for the interview for the post of MIS. And previously I was uploaded nearly 11 I think so. 11 MIS interview questions already uploaded. Whoever subscribed to my channel those people only will get the notification of the MIS interview question. If you have any suggestions, queries, please let me know. And the one thing, I am directly uploading the video, I am not practicing or not editing the video. Here is the query. Okay, first of all, we will take some regions over here. Regions, control enter. Okay. Less than 30 days. Tab 30 to 60 days, tab 60 to 90 days, tab 90 greater than 90 days, greater than 90 days. Okay, that is the query. Okay. So, first of all, we will take randomly some regions, okay? So, here is the region. Choose RAN between 1, comma, 1, comma 5. 
close parenthesis comma east double quote guys here observe if i if i am hard coding this file number so you have to take five values over here whatever you take here the number in the rand between you have to take that many values over here okay i took five means you have to take five east west comma north comma south and central okay so i took five one two three four five okay control enter drag till 20 it's randomly it will take and randomly i will take some amount Rand between 10,000 to 50,000 50, and I already highlighted the range now I type control enter to populate selected range and I will convert this into a it's a formula so I will convert into a value control C control alt V for paste special V for values but it, it is converted so now it won't change anything now we will convert this one also control c control alt v values ok we will bold it control b and select this range for all borders alt h b a for all borders here we will take only outside the borders alt h b c keep outside borders ok guys now the interview asked that whenever i type any region over here the total of these things should come in this display in this cell whenever you change the region suppose east west north south so first of all i will do data validation for this east west north and some central so first of all I will do data validation for this here alt dl tab l for list tab select the range okay okay so here I will give you label sum of total uh, total region Total of region, we would total of okay, second, we would total of region. I do like this. Ampersand east. Okay, control enter. So it will give you whenever you change the region over here, it will give you the total of that ok see here this region when I change the central it shows you the total of region central ok now we have to do formula for this ok guys so simple first of all what you will do first of all find out how many centers are there in this ok guys so equal to control shift down arrow equal center I am not moving anywhere so I am not freezing this cell difference ok F9 so wherever you find the all falls you see through here only one through here I think so one through I mean the center is not there ok one through is there you can understand guys this one wherever it finds the central in this region it will show you the true ok so control G now wrap into this first of all we have to multiply this whole region ok wherever you find this number it is a true and multiplying with number so it will convert into a number ok 
So let's see, true, variable is point is a true, true into the value, true into the value, so it will convert into a number, as nice, see, 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, ok guys, all are zeros, mm, now some, now wrap this into a some sort of function, some product can handle array part. Okay, guys. F9. So it will show you the total. Control G, Control Enter. I will convert this into a currency. Control Shift 4. Remove the decimal. Alt H9, Alt H9. So to uh, remove the decimal part. Now check it. 1,52,173. 1,52,173. Some of this. Okay, whenever you change the cell from here, south. So it will show uh, how many souths are there. You have to count and it will show you the all south. Wait a minute, let's check. East, West, North, North, only one South is there, okay. Wait a minute guys, South, in the South, uh, the South only now, we can wait to swing like this. Wait a, guy, wait a minute guys, some problem over here, F9, sorry, F2. F9. Why it is showing like this? First of all, let's check. Should be some error, I think so. F9. How many souths are there? One south. Okay. So it should add one, two, three, four. These four things should add. Okay. Okay. Control G. Let me check here. F9, it will show you all things. Okay. It is showing only one, I think so, guys, right? F9. How many shows? One, two, three. It is showing only one. South. It is only this one, okay? South is there. So let us check. South 197069. The right is showing the total wrong F9. Oh, why is it saying wait a minute, guys? 19769. It is 1234. Here it may be. Um, there it is. 197691234. Um, let me check why it is showing the wrong accurate, it should, it should not show the wrong answer, it has to show the correct one, because it is the right one. Mm, okay, we change another one, okay, it is getting confused. Control enter. South region, yes, south region. Yes, correct only now it is showing why I am, how do you? Hari Burn, correct only, 1,17,255, correct only, if you want you can change it to East, East here, yes. another 2 East is for this, 4 East is for this, right, why it is showing wrong? Okay, another east also, I did not add another east. Right. See, 7 lakhs at 1014. 7 lakhs at 1014. Okay, guys. Now I will show you the condition format. And some people, what they will do, I will show you. If the interview asks, I want the region total, total of that. So, some people will do like this. Control shift, and for filter shortcut. 
so they will convert it to a yeast select all yeast ok now what they will do they will they will add this alt equal enter and they will drag formula like this and they will do again alt equal why it is going wrong ok it is taking the sub total as to so 109 no 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 it has to come as to the region is correct they will add like this see east region total but it is showing wrong it has to show correct only I don't know why it is showing the wrong I think it has taken ok so it is you should not do like this ok use the formula use the formula and do like this ok ok it is adding this all thing, these things it is not adding the e, only the yeast check it here so don't do like this do like this ok guys now I will do I will show you the conditional format for this alt o, alt h l n for conditional format this one equal is this it has to check row not the column so log the column equal to this one ok we are freezing this one excel will understand that it has to check only downwards not the sidewards ok it has to check only the row the column not the row so I am lock, locking the column but not the row ok format with uh, bold fill color with uh, this one font automatic white ok so it will show like this wherever it finds the region it will show like this the whole thing ok guys check it now what's wrong in this alt h l R to manage the rules B ok that is it ok I logged only B yes only B part it has to check and I for correct exactly what's wrong in this I for ok I have taken wrong condition it has to check this one I2 not I4 so I did I4 for that reason it has it has not shown here ok now apply ok if you change the region why only conditional format what why we have to use the conditional format so it is a visual cue automatically easily and automatically and we can find it ok guys if it is large data so we are unable to find it out where it is so when you do conditional format easily we can find it out that one ok guys thank you guys thanks for your support have a nice day happy learning and learning i will meet you in next session thank you guys hi friends how are you all here your friend Rajnikant excel guru before I start this session, I request everyone to like, share and subscribe my channel. Like, if you like then YouTube people will suggest to those people who are eagerly waiting for MIS interview questions. So if you like it's better for others also. If you subscribe it's better for you. If you share it will be better for your friends. So for that reason I am uh, requesting you to like, share and subscribe my channel. Here is the query and uh, one thing guys I don't want to reveal the company names because it's strictly I promise to them that I, ne I never share company names. Right? So here is the interview my question asked by one of the interviewers who came for the candidate. 
for the post of MIS Management Information System. Okay. It's so it's not a big video, it's very small video. So guy asked the dear asked you have to count total length of the characters which, you, which are in the random data random data okay, random data so I am taking random data like this okay. so you have to count how many characters total characters not single characters total characters in the range so so many people what they will do they will do like this and we open the bracket, take this one, control C, not control C, sorry, take this one, control and type, double click, and they will count like this, all equal, and that. So, this is the big procedure, so within span of 10 seconds, if the entry asked to complete within span of 10 seconds, they may, he needs to he, he, he needs to ask what are the total characters of the this thing. It takes more than 10 seconds. I, I assure you it takes more than 10 seconds. Now, less than 10 seconds, first of all, I, I, I will explain you. Later, I will show you within less than 10 seconds in, in one single formula. Is equal to learn, open the bracket, take this on. It, it won't take this one, so you have to turn. First of all, I am explaining for that reason some product and okay, some product and control enter. Some products can handle array, so total characters. <coughs> if they ask how many values are there in this page? How many values are there in this range? Okay, you can use a counter. Fourteen values. Now see, less than ten seconds. I will how how I will do. Oh, sorry, now counter. Okay guys, so be keep concentration and try to find out the questions from the videos which I am uploading. Thanks for your support, have a nice day, thank you guys. Hi friends, here is your friend Rajnikant, Excel Guru. So, before I start this session, before I explain this session, I request everyone to like, share and subscribe my channel. And after subscribe, click on bell icon. And one thing I like to say with you guys, after completion of MIS interview questions, then only I will start a different function. Each and every function. The total MIS interview questions are 100 plus, 100 plus. It may be 110, 120, 200, 250, like that. It may be any, the figure is anything. Okay. So I'm still collecting and it may get uh, two months or three months. But it's very important nowadays. MIS interview questions are very important. I collected from different of companies from Hyderabad. So many companies, really. And uh, some companies personally I went for interview. So from there I collected. Some of the guys called me and said that uh, about this from the WhatsApp group and Telegram group about the MIS interview questions. Now some companies I went personally for interviews. Okay, guys. So here is the solution for here is the query for that. The person asked the interview asked to the candidate who came for the interview for the post of MIS. So here is that. 
wherever you find this car wherever you find this car over in this data then only car should extract in the columns like this ok guys like this it has to extract if it is if you find any jeep over here it should extract only jeep ok so now uh, if you want you can change it like a Audi cow is there so cow is not there Audi 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 also not there here so. mm, GMC 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 not there so I will write GMC after bike so GMC or the Jeep is there GMC Jeep is there so GMC bike now so it won't work I think so because yes GMC bike is also it is come it will go under this bike ok it will go under this bike if it is bike if it is jeep it will go under this jeep column ok I will delete this one first of all is equal to search this thing comma it is a related reference for that reason I am not locking that one as for close parenthesis so it will show the position where the car will start ok it just will count 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 maybe 9 ok see remaining or all see wherever you find the car it will show you this 6 ok guys so we have to find it out what is that ok so is numbered if it is numbered so we are converting errors into false and numbers into truth if it is number means if it is number if it finds a, the number in this search area so it will convert into a true if it is not it will convert into a false so is number f9 let's see so wherever you find the numbers it will show you the true okay. just i will copy this one i need this one some product will it work let's see some product now this close parameter f9 it will show you the error see so some product will not understand the true and false so it will understand only ones and zeros if you convert by pressing by typing double negative before this is number so it will convert into a number now f9 ok guys control enter double click ok somewhere something wrong what is it? ok I hard coded this one sorry I hard coded this one for that reason control G G F2 is equal to some product if you hard code that one it will show you the error ok I already copied this one F9 A control G control enter don't hard code that one ok wherever it finds it will show you this one ok guys bike how many bikes are there the bikes are here ok is equal to index open the bracket we need index ok first of all we need index index this part f4 comma small if control v it, it will show you whether it is true or false f9 true true whenever it will show the true what it will do ok first of all I will suspend this formula for a while and I will convert this into some black now so white is better um, maybe green let's try green so wherever it finds it will show you if it shows the truth then it will take the rows from here ok f4 minus row open the bracket this one only f4 plus 1 so what it will take let's see from row part I am copying the row part still row part f9 ok where I did wrong here values 
two. Last nine. One, two, three, four, three. We need from first part. Okay, guys. Control G. If it is true, it will take that position of this row. Okay. If it, is, if it finds any two over here. Okay. Comma. Now, we, we need to extract two columns. So, you have to use columns. Columns. E dollar that dollar E cut in locking the column not the row E cut in close parenthesis close parenthesis close parenthesis okay now we let's I'll explain you first of all you will take logical test so this is the logical test click on this it will highlight that one and press F9 so whenever it finds true it will take that position first of all okay See here it is true. Okay, I'll do one thing. Control G, Control Shift and Enter. F2. Because I have to again I have to type for that reason. Logical test F9. So it is true. Okay guys. Value of true F9. See what it will do. It will multiply. If I sorry, it will take this is true. So it will take first part of this and again third part. This two parts it will take, and from that it will take first smallest and second smallest from the columns. Now it is showing one. If you drag the copy, if you copy this formula, it will show you one, two, three, four, like it. till wherever you copy. Okay, guys. So escape, revert to the formula. It will show you some errors. I will tell you. I will reserve this errors. Copy. Is it right? Let me check. So here it is showing wrong. I think so. Everything is right. Again, why it is showing wrong? It should not show wrong. Right. Okay. Actually, I did not log anything here. Okay. This is the problem. You have to log F2. Search. It has to copy the column, but not the Row part. It has to check this downwards. Okay, guys. Now control shift and enter. Double click. And if you are in array part, don't use this error. So it will take longer. So it's better. Okay. Control C. Don't use this error. Use the columns function. Columns greater than count. Log the column, but not the row. Greater than then double quote else run this formula. If you use if error, it will take long time to calculate and because the if error function will clear calculate each and every cell. If it is a large data, don't use if error. If you use this type of trick, so what it will do after going more than two, it will stop automatically. It will stop there. Okay, guys, automatically it will stop. If it crosses second column, so automatically just stop over there. It won't calculate. It will stop and it will blindly it will uh, place the value empty. Okay, for that reason, control shift and enter. Oh, oh it's another part. Sorry, I'm sorry. It's an array part, so we have to copy. This is the major part. Control C, escape. First of all, delete this one. Control V, escape. Add this formula. Again, what happened? Again, what happened? Where is the function? Greater than two. Everything wrong. Everything is right, but it doesn't do. Okay. Actually, I used the normal function. Control Shift and Enter. Drag this formula. Double click over here. Right, guys. If you want, you can check it over there. Okay, guys. Wherever you find the car, it will take only the car part. If you if you find truck, it will take only truck. If you find jeep, it will take from this data only jeep. Ashok Leyland truck. 
जीत जीएम सी जीत ओनली वन जी एम यू वॉन्ट यू कैन सी जीत टू एफ टू जीएस जे एच एम सी जी एम सी विल टेक कार ठीक है नॉट कार साइकिल सी वाई सी एल यू बिकॉज इट इज एन एम पी पार्ट सो विल टेक दिस वन कंट्रोल एंड टच अब यू गाइस ओके गाइस थैंक यू थैंक्स एंड हैप्पी लर्निंग एंड अर्निंग विल मीट यू इन नेक्स्ट सेशन about MIS interview questions thank you guys thanks for your support have a nice day